Hello everybody. Today's video, we're going to call it ULTY the day after. Yesterday I put out a short celebrating that um, we would receive a $1.06 per share payment for ULTY and you know that is that was fantastic news. So we would expect that the day after that announcement, we call it the X date, that we'll see a healthy pullback of at least a dollar six. But today we are surprised, I am anyway, that we had an additional drop off of 63 cents. So if you add those two together, we're down, you know, about a uh, dollar 70. And, you know, so that makes the share price uh, 17.95 today. And I, you know, my plan was is to buy a little more shares. And I had originally purchased 60 shares on the opening day, so it was a little more than $20 a share. So I bought an additional 20, and that brought my average down to 19.62 a share. So, you know, lesson learned: I should have shown more patience on the opening of the stock, uh, but I had my reasons. You know, I missed out on Misty, and I jumped in on Ulti because of my regret, right? So I need to use less emotions and more patience. But anyway, that's my problem. So um, I, on a previous video that I will link to, I described that I put together a watch list to help me understand why is Ulti going down? So let's quickly jump into the uh, five-day chart. And you can see that we see our dollar six drop as we would expect. And, you know, we always consider this a buying opportunity, but we have an additional drop off that I want to learn more about. So we'll head over to my watch list that I created. Uh, by the way, this is not financial advice, and I don't recommend that anybody buys this stock. Um, it's a it's a new offering from YieldMax, and we're not exactly sure what's going to happen. But there is one thing for sure. Time will tell. But this is not financial advice. So. Um, I want to know why is Ulti pulling back. So I go to my Ulti holdings and uh, we can see that we got a lot of red here and we certainly only have a little bit of green. So let's see. Um, the stock market is having a slight pullback today, but it's, 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 it's a gentle pullback. Only 0.22% from, you know, the S&P and we're, it's showing 0% for the NASDAQ and only 0.17% for the Dow. So we see that some of the uh, ulti holdings are pulling back pretty hard and we'll go over them real quick. And that is a firm is pulling back at 8.84%. So to me, that's huge, right? But uh, I mean, we've seen worse than that lately. But when you have uh, Chewy pulling back at 3.75, we're saying, hey, thank you for not pulling back uh, more. And we have Clean Spark, and I this one is almost always down, right? It seems to me, it just has wild swings. I should say, um, it's down 8.47 percent at the time of this recording, and we have Coin is down 4.8 uh, percent, Carvana is down 3.21, GCT 3.39, Mara is a, a Bitcoin-related stock, and it's down 8.45. So starting to see here that coin and Mara, and if I cheat a little and go down to MSTR and Riot, we got um, a Bitcoin problem. So let's take a look at Bitcoin and that um, that's pulling back pretty good today. So it's down 1,721. And I believe yesterday it was around 73. And now it's, you know, down into the 71 range. So we can see little insight on why these Bitcoin related holdings are in the downward motion. Just to finish up here, we got Labu is down 6.93%. We got Riley is down 7.69%. So that tells us, that tells the story of why Ulti is down $1.70 today. And, you know, we'll see. I'm really making this video for myself so that I can play it back in 30 days and see if, did we recover from this 1795, uh, you know, position or did, or will we look back at 1795 as the good old days, right? I'm uh, just curious to see 
what happens. So I hope that you can uh, give this video. Yeah, I want to stay logged in. So I hope you give this video a thumbs up. I could really use it. Maybe even subscribe. Uh, tomorrow or Saturday, I'm going to launch a video that shows, that highlights my biggest mistake that I made in the stock market, or at least the, the, the most money that I lost at one time. And I think that, it, you know, it'll be entertaining. And I hope that you can uh, take a look at that and hit the notification button so that uh, YouTube tells you about it. Thanks for stopping by.